getting back to your question, mm. the Big Bang. So we have top people working on trying to resolve the singularity problem. And in so doing, you get to some ideas that, well, maybe our Big Bang, because the Big Bang is not going to go away. All the data support this. So now I've got this Big Bang thing, okay? And, well, is this embedded in something bigger? Mm. Ooh. Ooh. So when you put, like, quantum physics and general relativity and you try to come up with some bigger understanding, deeper understanding, string theorists have been all into this, you get a multiverse. We didn't pull that out of our ass. That came out of the equations. So how old is the multiverse? I don't know. It's definitely older than our universe because it birthed our universe and it births other universes and it births the way the equations drive it, an infinity of universes. This is the idea that maybe there's a version of us in another yeah. where I'm bald and you got the afro and who is, but everything else is the same. And also a version where everything's the same. Where everything would be the same, yes. Everything you've ever said has been said before exactly in the same order. Correct. There's no reason to presume that everything in this universe isn't or hasn't already played out in the exact way in another one of these infinite universes. And in an infinite number of different ways. Correct. And so that that is what comes out of the equations. So that makes the Big Bang a kind of a small part of a much larger whole. Mm. 